Hi everyone, let's talk a little bit more about breakouts. There are so many different ways of, uh, of uh, making breakouts. I've got the stripes in this particular situation and here's the, uh, here's the cluster of balls I've got that are in trouble. And there's, there, again, there's different ways to do this, but I want to avoid putting myself in a position where I have to use a lot of, of, um, of draw. Say I stop on the 14 and try to draw off the 9. That would be one way to do it. Another way to do it would be to shoot the 13 and, 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 and let the 14 be my last ball. But like I said, I don't really like it when, you're, when, uh, when the last ball you shoot is the one that does the, uh, the breakout. You want to shoot, break them out earlier. So I like this technique instead. You come around here and you, you use the angle of the 13 to make the breakout. So you shoot the 14 and, and stop it dead so you can keep your, keep your angle on the 13. And then you use the 13 for your breakout. Just a little bit of middle right. <clears throat> and there you go, that's an excellent breakout. And notice we have an easy shot at the 15. We didn't have it on our outlet ball. But anyway, again, the technique, the best technique of breaking out is to use angles, to use angles to create your speed, and you want to have an outlet ball. You don't have to play like a pro to enjoy the game I love. If you've ever played in a friend's basement, you can compete in an APA league. In the APA, everyone can play and anyone can win. So if you're looking for a fun night out with your friends and family, join an APA Pool League today. Have fun, meet people, play pool. Visit poolplayers.com today.